Pepper. I'm in front of Unido at Shaw. Slayer espresso machine. Some milk slurpage was happening there with the Slayer. It's got a whole lot coming through. Yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy Connor from Single Sip American Coffee Trip here in Washington, D.C. again in like a, in an in-between building little area thing. There's like hanging shit up there. There's uh, other businesses, other things going on. Street's right out there. I'm in front of Unido at Shaw. They are a coffee roaster. Got two locations. I believe this is their secondary location, but I will be at their main shop later today. They had a Slayer espresso machine. That's a good sign. There's only one coffee shop that's had a Slayer espresso machine that hasn't gotten top pick. They were in Middlebury, Vermont. I remember them specifically. Little Seed Coffee Roasters. Milk. Espresso brown streaks coming through. Just like it is here. We got some brown streakage on the top there. But we also got some crisp latte art lines. And definitely some milk slurpage was happening there with the Slayer. Do we have a break up in the... Oh, nice. That's actually pretty consistent right there. Yeah. That is a bit liquidy. I like it to be a bit more... Is viscous the word? Viscous. Viscosicus. I like it to be a bit more viscosicus. So, uh, yeah. Let's find out how good this is. Slayer, do me proud. Okay, that's a delicious espresso. The milk's actually pretty good. It was steamed right. But there's not a lot coming through. As much as I thought there would be. But it is good enough for me to give it a 7.8. It's a bit too hot. Make me wince a little bit every time I take a sip. You just slap your hand on the bottom of that pitcher, feel out the milk temperature, you'll get the results that you want, right? It's fucking cold out here. We're like in a wind tunnel right now. So, everything's just blowing on through here. My arm hairs are starting to come up a little bit. That's just the way it is. Oh. Oh. First one of the day. All right. Oh. Ugh. Okay. That being said, guys, we're going to see you guys at Bourbon Coffee down the street later.